everyone. Today I want to talk a little bit about ways you can raise a child into a financially responsible adult. So if your kid is anything like my daughter, she just thinks money comes out of nowhere. But one of the things we've been working to teach her is that it doesn't and that you have to be responsible with how you spend. Today I'm working with Money Saving Generation to show you a wonderful tool that can help teach your child about financial responsibility. So this is a sponsored video, but as always, all opinions are mine. So this is a Money Saving Pig. It comes in blue, pink, green, and purple, and our box says ours is pink. So let's open this pig. He's so cute. Okay, so what makes this piggy bank unique is it has four sections. There is a section for save, spend, donate, and invest. Okay, so it comes with stickers, and we're not going to put those on right now, but we will put them on our pig. I think it is a valuable tool in teaching a child how to manage their own money. It's really sturdy, too. Like, this plastic is really thick. Um, besides that, it also came with this little brochure. And it's just a guide on how to use it. it. has smart investing tips. There's a QR code on the back. Sarah loves putting change into a piggy bank. And we have, like, three piggy banks, so this one will get a lot of love. So this bank is such a wonderful tool, but I have a few other suggestions. Okay, so my first other suggestion is to have your child practice writing out like play checks. You can do this when you're playing store or doctor's office or just when you're having some table time. I know checks are a little outdated, but I still write them. Uh, the last daycare I had my daughter in did not accept debit cards, so I wrote a check every week. And I think that's a skill that they don't necessarily learn in school. As a bonus, it's a good way to sneak in name writing and some literacy and math skills. Okay, so the last suggestion I have is involve your child in planning your budget. Now that doesn't mean I tell my four-year-old exactly how much we make or what we spend, but it does mean that we teach her that we have a budget and that we like to stick to it. For instance, anytime we go to Target or Walmart, she gets a toy but we've taught her that the toy has to be under $10. So we go through the aisles and we tell her the price and then she decides if that's a little treat which she can have or a big treat that we have to save for a special occasion. If it's a big treat, she'll usually decide to put it on her list for Santa or the Easter Bunny got quite a long list this year too. <laughs> this helps her learn um, that there's a time and a place to buy things, that you can't buy big things every time you go to a store. At least we can. Maybe someday we'll be able to. So I hope these suggestions can inspire you to teach your child about money at an early age. If you want to pick up one of these piggy banks, they're $19.99 and I'll put the link below. If you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to let me know in the comments. And if you're new here, don't forget to hit subscribe. I'll see you later.